Hi, my name is Tara Kujadar, and I'm the co-founder and co-director of the Traditional Arts and Ethnology Center. Today, I'm pitching to you Artisan Origins by TAC, an opportunity to invest in crafts and culture here in Laos. TAC was started in 2007 by myself and my co-director to promote more understanding and appreciation for the cultural diversity of Laos. We run a museum with temporary and permanent exhibitions on different topics and themes around culture. And we continue to conduct research in communities, do school outreach activities, and maintain a collection. We also run two brick and mortar handicraft shops where we sell products from over 600 producers with whom we work from all over the country. 50% of the income from these shops goes directly back to our artisans who are primarily rural ethnic minority women, the poorest population in the country. We also advocate for protection of their traditional designs in terms of intellectual property. The opportunity we see today is in Paxé in Southern Laos, the capital of Champasak province. Champasak has Wat Pu, the World Heritage Site, as well as the 4,000 Islands, and is also close to the borders with Thailand and Cambodia. In 2019, before COVID, Champasak received over 785,000 international visitors, an increase of 73% over four years. However, there are no good handicraft shopping opportunities in this part of the country, despite Southern Laos having a diversity of basketry, textiles, and wood carving. This is where Artisan Origins by TAC comes in. This would be a branch of a successful brand selling handicrafts from Southern Laos, but from also all over the country. It would be based on our successful model of telling the background behind the crafts. It would talk about the cultures behind them, the techniques, the materials, and the people who produce these textiles and crafts. It would also be based on the product development that we do. We take traditional designs, traditional skills, and help shape them into products that would meet a more international market and contemporary tastes. Before COVID, our shops had a retail conversion rate of 22% and an average transaction value of $30. Our projections for artisan origins use similar numbers. <clears throat> Because of the broad range of visitors to Southern Laos, our products will range from small souvenirs to collector's items pieces. The team setting up Artisan Origins has worked together for over 10 years at TAC and includes myself, my co-director Kuhn, and our general manager, Guy. Artisan Origins would expand on our community impact. Our artisans in 2019 earned over $128,000 directly based on our 50-50 sharing mechanism. With Artisan Origins, we project an additional earning of $80,000 in year one to artisans, rising to $200,000 in year three. TAC employs 20 people in Wompabang and we envision employing an additional five people to work in Southern Laos. Based on our projections, TAC would need a startup investment of $70,000 in order to start Artisan Origins. Artisan Origins would be based on our strong brand and dedicated team, an untapped tourism market, a sound business model that is proven, and would be an investment in rural ethnic minority women. Thank you very much.